What's up guys, Leopold the Brave here and welcome to Universes Mini. Um, I just wanted to get something out this week since I didn't have anything at all planned. And I figured this would be easy because I just had an endoscopy yesterday, so my throat's a little bit sore, but not too much. But I didn't really feel like making anything big, so here's Universes Mini. For this episode, I just wanted to take a look back at where I am in versus debating and how far I've come and how awful my start was. So I guess the first thing I should start out with is my actual research, which has improved a lot since the beginning, because now I do actual research. Back then, um, I think the only one I researched was Jin vs. Ryu, my very first debate, because it was the one that kickstarted my whole interest in versus because I wanted to find out who wins that. And even though my stats for Tekken are way higher than they were before from new research, which means Jin absolutely stomps Ryu now, I was, I'm was i still very impressed for how I reasoned why Jin would win for when I did believe he was at the stats back then. However, that was like the only one of my early episodes that I actually researched like crazy. Um, let's see, Rayman vs. Spyro. I don't remember a single thing about research I did there. <laughs> I think I looked up like two feats for each of them, and then just slapped them in the episode and was like, Oh, this one's greater, Rayman wins, even though Rayman probably totally loses that fight. <laughs> and then there's uh, Crash vs. Ty. Um, I had only played the first Ty game. And I just watched through stuff on the second and third, and I don't think I took any notes, I just watched through them. And didn't include very much stuff, so who knows, Ty could win that one, he couldn't. I may revisit it later someday to see if the results changed, but yeah, that one was also very poorly researched. And then, and then don't, ev don't even get me started on Saitama versus Goku. That's where I started pulling out the lowball stuff and excuses like Goku gets hurt by an attack that creates a crater, but Saitama doesn't, therefore Saitama wins. No, Leo. Versus doesn't work like that. <laughs> it reminds me of like uh, Sephiroth versus Ichigo, another episode of a Oh crap. Another episode of a Versus show that I will not name by a YouTuber that I will not name because I don't like to call people out. I really didn't mean to bring that up, but it does it does remind me of my early days in Versus, like the really bad Saitama versus Goku days. Like this particular video had it was angry at Death Battle for having Sephiroth beat Virgil. So out of spite, it was a fight where Sephiroth lost and he was extremely lowballed and everything, like Bullet level Final Fantasy, I'm not even kidding. It reminds me of when uh, Death Battle made Bowser vs. Ganon, and I was so angry at it that I had uh, a Ganon vs. Akuma, and I mean, Ganon still won, but I lowballed the heck out of Ganon, and show it just hammered in how he still can get hurt by regular weapons, and they don't have to be sacred or anything. So yeah, the Ichigo vs. Sephiroth fight that I'm mentioning reminds me a lot of my early days, my not good early days. But yeah, I really didn't mean to bring that video up, so if you know which Nar uh, Ichigo versus um, Sephiroth video I'm talking about, please don't go harass the video or whoever made it, because you know I don't like to call out people. I think the only time I ever did that was that five biggest problems with the versus community video where I specifically said I was going to call out people, even though I don't like to. But yeah, you get the point. It's just, it's just what the excuse is, man. I was really bad at that, like in my Mario vs. Sonic video. I lowballed the heck out of Sonic. Even though I really didn't need to because Mario wins anyways, but yeah, I I really lowballed Sonic there, and I'm really sorry for that. Sonic gets hurt when falling from space, therefore he loses. Oh boy. But those first 10 episodes of Fictional Fights is mostly where the bad ends. Now we move on to the good. Universes. I love working on universes, even though I get tired of it sometimes. I still love working on it. Now for all of Fictional Fights, it was 100% me. I had no help at all whatsoever. Well, I mean, I did have Harutsun X voicing um, the host Hira, but I mean, in the research department and everything, it was all me, which probably explains a lot of my mistakes, because I guarantee you, if I had a research team and I said Saitama won, they would have not let, they would have made sure I didn't hear the end of it. <laughs> but with universes and the way it's formatted with predictions and comments and poll votes and everything, I can sort of get an idea of who should win a lot easier by having the comments chip in information, having the predictions given their side of the argument. Because I mean, if I had a specific research team, they might all like one thing more and lead more to one side or to the other side. But with predictions, you get arguments coming in from both sides, so you get to hear even more of the conversation and debate. Not only that, but since I got a Discord server last year, a lot of people on Discord have been helping me with fights too. 
Like, there's a whole versus debate section on my Discord. I'll even link my Discord in the description below, or in a comment below, whatever. But yeah, on my Discord, there's a whole versus section. There's calculation channels, debating channels, research channels, suggestion channels, and everything. So people chip in calculations and research, and it's all crazy. But thanks to all that, I think my research has been better than it ever has before. And of course, I, I still make some mistakes or two. No versus debater is perfect. No person is perfect. I mean, there is one perfect person, Jesus, and look what they did to him, hung him on a cross and all that, yikes. But overall, I think it's completely safe to say that my versus debating has gotten better. I'm pretty sure people prefer Chun-Li versus Tigress over Rayman versus Spyro, Brian versus Genos over Danny versus Jake, and I'm definitely positive that people 100% prefer Superman versus Goku over Saitama versus Goku. Oh boy. So yeah, that was a look back at my versus then and my versus now. Leopold the Brave, signing off.